you are not defined by your gear. Hold, wait, hold that thought. You see, there's something that's just really important that I need in order to make this video the right way. So I gotta go grab it real quick. And then I guess we can get back to the video. I need a sausage McMuffin and that'd be it. Thank you so much, you too. I got the gold. It's about to go down. to get a drink man man this happens every day I'm glad I got all that under control oh mine are hot oh that is too hot to drink Woo! so as I was saying before I spilled coffee all over my white shirt and had to change do not let your gear define you don't let it stop you from creating. I understand, you know, people are going through a hard financial time right now, but it should be no reason why you feel like you are less capable of doing creative video work or creative photography work just because you may have limited gear. As an example, for the last 12 months before, you know, I could upgrade a lot of my gear, I was shooting with this for photography and videos. This is a T6i. Well, it's out of focus because I've got face track on right now. But this is a Canon Rebel T6i. This camera body right now, you can find on Amazon for about 400 bucks. I'll put a link in the description. This is a Nifty 50 lens. It's the cheapest lens that Canon makes that's a prime lens. It's an f1.8, but it's, it's, a, it's a $100 lens. You know what I'm saying? I was able to shoot video and photos with this camera that started my career as a photographer and videographer. And I know, you know, a lot of people are gonna be like, why would you do that? How did you make that happen? Well, oftentimes, if you're willing to learn and you're willing to go above and beyond with your editing and your post process, you can squeeze a whole lot of detail and a whole lot of dynamic range out of what you're just working with. You know, some people, they might just have an iPhone. Don't let that stop you. Back when I was using this camera, literally up until two weeks ago, understand that up until two weeks ago, I was making money as a photographer and videographer up until two weeks ago with this camera. And that's okay because the quality I was able to deliver to my clients was awesome and superb. But, you know, oftentimes I would have to use my iPhone 11 for slow-mo clips because this body is not capable of slow-mo. Makes sense? And matter of fact, I'm going to right now show you over top of me talking some clips of videos I shot with this camera. I'm not saying if you can afford a better situation to not do it. I'm saying definitely, you know, buy whatever you can afford to purchase within your budget. But if all you have is less than $600, this camera is good enough to make you money as a photographer and videographer. Like, yes, upgrade as soon as possible, but that's literally what I did. I utilized the tools I had and that I could afford at the time to get me to a place where I could afford better tools. And, and I'm always an advocate that if you make $5,000 off of something and you're in business for yourself, if you can afford to, spend that $5,000 right back in gear because then you're going to make way more money in the future and then you can take it out. A lot of people that are in business for themselves often say, do not take a dollar out of your business for the first year or two. And what they mean by that is all the money that you're able to have as profits from being in business that first couple of years, 
They're saying to take it out to reinvest into new equipment that can help you better do your business, better marketing, run more diverse ads and whatnot. But I'm simply saying, do not let your gear define you. Because if you saw some of those videos that I had overlaid with me talking, even the most basic of gear can get you into a position to where you can get better gear if you utilize the gear you already have in a correct way. The thing is, this camera body right here, the T6i, as funny as it is to talk about, the technology that's in this camera body was unheard of 20 years ago. Professional photographers that we have come to adore the work of in magazines and in papers and whatnot when we were growing up, they were using gear that was nowhere near as capable as even something like this T6i. But we found as children when we were growing up, man, we would love to get into photography or videography. Look at these pictures by these people that took those pictures. Well, they took those pictures on legacy gear compared to this. So if they were able to spark interest in our minds as children with their artwork through using suboptimal gear compared to even this right here, then why are you going to let something stop you even if this is all you can afford? Because I promise something like this is going to get you to a place where you can have something way better. With social media these days and the internet, it's easy to see the latest and greatest and feel less than if you don't have it. But you got to separate your ego from your mind and be a positive person. Think optimistically because then positive things will happen in your life. But yeah, that's all I have for today's video. I wanted to have the ability with this video to inspire the young creative minds that maybe financially aren't doing so well to the point where they can afford pro grade gear and allow them to know that they can make a career with the gear that they have if they learn to use it the right way. That's what life's about, doing the best you can with what you have until you can upgrade and do better. I got love for you guys. I hope everything goes well for you this week. If you have any questions or comments, drop them down below. I'll get back to you when I get the chance. I'll comment back and whatever. Let me know how you feel about what I've talked about in this video. Share with me, maybe even in the comment section, what video camera you use to start out with with your career. And maybe that would also help inspire other creators that are just getting started in their walk of life. But yeah, stay safe.